JMS Flower Farms has been helping grape growers protect their vines from insects and fungal diseases with their exclusive product, JMS Stylet Oil, since 1992. Visit www.stylitoil.com today. Hello, I'm Matthew Malcolm with California Ag Network reporting to you here in Madera, California. I'm here with Manuel Marin, a raisin grower here in Madera. I'm in his vineyard. Uh, we're talking about cover crops, specifically legumes and their nitrogen-fixing capabilities. I think everybody, uh, most growers would know about this and about how good it, these cover crops are for the soil and for these plants. But, you know, as far as timing, what's what's the ideal timing and what signs do you look for when it's time to, to till it under and get, you know, cash out the most uh, nutrition you can get out of these? No, oh, Matthew, uh, you, you bring a good point. And there is a timing so you can get your most uh, bang for your buck, as they would say, uh, with these legumes uh, it's real simple you know usually when it gets you know three feet tall it's usually about time but there's a real tell that you can see and that is you got to pull these stalks out out of the ground look at these root nodules you'll see little root nodules here um, you're looking for coloring you want a red as red as you can get on these on these root nodules and that's when you know it's time that you're going to get the most nitrogen from these legumes to get back into your soil and then hence till it in yeah, do you have any recommendations as far or preferences as far as what you guys do specifically for these these crops? Um, I like legumes, the vetch. You know, it's a it's a mix of fava beans, garbanzo beans, vetch, um, and those tend to give us the most benefits uh, in nitrogen in terms of nitrogen. Because, uh, like I said, we could really see the root nodules on these particular plants, legumes, and when they're red, it's time to till them in or disc them in. Great, and that time is uh, quickly approaching here. It's pretty close. As you see here, some of them are starting to get red. Some of them are still white. But it's, uh, it's usually, usually Easter time is the, is the time where it's, uh, it's right, uh, is right, the right time. <laughs> Great. Well, thank you. You've heard it on California Ag Network. I'm Matthew Malcolm, CaliforniaAgNet.com.